Now, ladies, we're hoping that what we do here today will establish a model for women who are grouping all over the country. Some people are uncomfortable with volunteering. Yes, there's phone banking, there's canvassing, there's voter registration, there's data uh, entry. Um, there are all these different things that need to be done. Ask yourself, what is my gift? What is my talent? If you don't do anything but tell the sisters in your neighborhood, at your church, in your sorority groups, uh, just tell them, we can, we must, and we will reelect President Barack Obama for 2012. Tell them, tell them. If we don't do something now to make sure that this president is back in office, we can kiss the health care reform goodbye. I invite you to stand and applaud and invite Dr. Richard Davis to the podium. Everybody in this room can make a difference. And we start one step at a time, and we start by educating ourselves. And some of the things that we're going to talk about today, which is a focus on women's health and what President Barack Obama has accomplished during his tenureship. He has accomplished what others have tried and failed. He got health care reform passed. Yeah. Yeah. Being. I stand here this evening very, very, extremely proud, extremely proud of what these ladies who are wearing black and pearls, what they've done this afternoon. I'm a bit even more if there's such a term proud of this little lady over here. <laughs> and look at what she has done. Event number two, a big hat.